Hey, what's up? I'm Ryan Moore, and you're watching Threadbanger's Viewer Takeover. This week's lesson, I'm gonna show you how to make a pair of shorts out of an old t-shirt, just in time for summer. Intermediate. I learned how to make these from cutoutandkeep.com. They're posted by member Tara M. You're gonna need a large or extra large t-shirt, scissors, measuring tape, chalk or a pen, and a sewing machine. The first step is you're gonna chop off the sleeves right below the seam. Next, you're going to want to cut off the collar from one side to the other. Now you're gonna cut your t-shirt straight up the middle, making sure it's even on both sides. The next step is to flip both your t-shirt pieces over so the sleeve holes are in the middle. Now take your two pieces, open them up, and put them right sides together. Next, you're gonna sew the crotch seam. Throw some pins in it to keep it in place. Now, fold your shirt so it looks like you have an inside out pair of pants. This part's kind of tricky, but this is how I did it. Take the top layer, push it over the seam. Grab the two ends of the seam and bring them together. Grab these two ends, these two ends. Ta-da! Once you figure that out, pin and sew down both of your sides. Remember those sleeves? We're gonna use them to make the waistband. You're gonna take your sleeves and square them off. I'm gonna do this by drawing a straight line down from the end of one sleeve and across from the shorter end of the sleeve. Now cut out the two squares that you made. Now you're gonna open up your two squares and lay them right sides together on top of each other. Next, you're going to pin and sew the two shorter sides together. Now lay out your band right sides together. Flip it so one of your seams is in the middle. So take one edge of your seam and fold it over on top of the other one. Now take your band and pull it over the top of your shorts. Now take one of your seams from your waistband and line it up with the front seam of your shorts. And now pin all the way around your shorts. Since my waistband is a little bit shorter than the top of my shorts, I'm gonna make sure to stretch the waistband as I pin it to the shorts. Now you're gonna sew on the waistband. Now that your waistband's on, you're pretty much done. You can either wear them like this or hem them to a length that you want. For more cool creations, you can check out my Etsy page, ryanmoore.etsy.com. And remember, if you have something you made, make sure you post it on the Threadbanger forums because I'll be watching you. Filmmakers, do you have 15 seconds? Next New Networks is partnering with the Ignite Film Festival and we're looking for 15 second films. Quick, fast, and fun. And you'll even have the chance to have your movie screened in front of hundreds of people in New York City. Learn more at the link below. My name is Adrian and I don't know what to do. I'm so scared. I was in the mall today and oh, everything was the same. Salutations, Threadbangers. I am called Josh. Um, just here to show a little project of mine. I picked up these cool little ninja mitts last night at a clothing swap. I thought that one thing above all could really make them awesome. Studs. Just, uh, I, I picked up this belt in New York City uh, one time on a whim. Way too small for me, but it's got about a million of these studs on it, so I'm taking them off with my Leatherman and putting them on the mitts. So, yeah. Please do try this at home. Okay, so let's get serious. Without 
banger. I would not have been able to make hardly any of the stuff I made thanks to all the tutorials, the episodes and all the feedback from everyone else who's on the forum. So I'd like to say a massive thank you to Threadbanger and I look forward to seeing even more tutorials and even more of everyone else's work. Hello Threadheads, this is Biohazard from the Threadbanger Guild. It is my pleasure to announce this month's Spotlight Banger, which also happens to be our newest member, Melissa Fashion. She creates beautiful dresses and fantastic accessories that you definitely have to check out. So please, visit her Etsy shop, make a purchase, and tell your friends about her. So until next time, I'll see you guys. Bye!